Lake Mary is a popular suburb of Orlando, Florida. There are many corporations and businesses in Lake Mary. A lot of people choose to live there because of the proximity to their work. Have you ever lived in Lake Mary? Let us know in the comments what your experience was like in Lake Mary. In this video, we'll talk about things to do, places to eat, the housing market, schools, and more. At the end of the video, I'll mention some potential negatives to living in Lake Mary. It's 30 minutes northeast of downtown Orlando, 45 minutes to Disney, 45 minutes to the closest beach, and 35 minutes to the Orlando International Airport. However, there's the Orlando Sanford International Airport, which is 15 minutes away from Lake Mary. There are lots of things to do in Lake Mary. There are some golf courses, but if you just want to have some fun with the whole family, Top Golf has a location in Lake Mary. There's the Lake Mary Sports Complex. It has sports fields, courts, along with a skate park. The Cross Seminole Trail goes through Lake Mary. Liberty Park has pavilions, fishing, and disc golf. There's some natural preserves and conservation areas that are near Lake Mary. If you want to learn about Lake Mary's history, you can check out the Lake Mary Museum. Mystique Escape Room is a fun experience with multiple rooms to escape from. There are lots of fun events throughout the year in Lake Mary, like the Lake Mary Farmer's Market that happens every Saturday in Central Park, a yearly arts festival, family fun days, wine art Wednesdays, and holiday events. For food, there's Don Julio's Mexican restaurant that has really good Mexican food, and they have a tequila bar. Cork and Olive is a spot for some great Italian food. Lonnie's Fusion Restaurant has many different options from seafood, American diner staples, and some Asian-inspired dishes. Lake Mary has some unique stores like Morris Family Market. They have locally grown produce, meats from their family farm, and more. They're also at some of the farmer's markets throughout Orlando. Pierre's Wine Cellar is a great place to pick up some wine. The Olive Pantry is the place to go for all of your olive oil and balsamic vinegar needs. There are lots of shops in the cute downtown area of Lake Mary to check out. Let's talk about housing in Lake Mary. We'll go into the MLS or Multiple Listing Service, which is a housing database for realtors, so you can get an idea of what the real estate market looks like in Lake Mary. These are homes that sold recently. Feel free to pause this so you can see how much homes sold for, what their square footage was, taxes, and other stats. This two bedroom, one bath condo is 800 square feet. It was built in 1994 and sold for $141,000. The condo fee is $295 a month. The taxes last year were $1,264 and was not homesteaded. If it was, the taxes may have been a little less expensive. This is in the gated community of Regency Park. This three bedroom, two bath, single family home is 1,500 square feet. It was built in 1994 and sold for $300,000. The annual HOA fee is $250. The taxes last year were $2,943 and wasn't homesteaded. The roof was recently replaced. This four bedroom, two bath home is 2,200 square feet. It was built in 2001 and sold for $550,000. The HOA fee is $2,300 a year. The taxes last year were $5,116 and wasn't homesteaded. It's in the Cherry Ridge section of the gated community Heathrow. It's one of the most popular communities in the Lake Mary area. This four bedroom, five bath home is 4,000 square feet. It was built in 2018 and sold for $1,070,000. The HOA fee is $2,640 a year. The taxes were $9,354 last year and wasn't homesteaded. The home is located in the gated community of Steeple Chase. I'll put a link in the description of my preferred homes for sale in Lake Mary. In Lake Mary, you'll find some condos and townhomes, but mainly single family homes. There are some gated communities. There are some older homes from the early 1900s, but a bulk of the homes are from the 70s, 80s, and 90s. There are some newer homes as well, but not many. If you're enjoying the video, please give me a like and comment. It really helps out the channel and consider subscribing if you haven't already. Lake Mary is in the Seminole County Public School District. I'll leave a link to a school zone map and school rankings in the description. There are private schools in Lake Mary like Lake Mary Prep and Heathrow Christian Academy. Let's talk about some potential negatives to living in Lake Mary. There can be quite a bit of traffic in Lake Mary, especially during commuting hours with all the corporations that are in Lake Mary. The housing can be expensive compared to neighboring areas like Sanford, Longwood, and Winter Springs. There isn't much of a nightlife in Lake Mary.
I've also heard people say there aren't enough entertainment options. Another place to consider is Sanford. Check out that video here and this playlist about other areas of Orlando. Reach out if you have any questions. Thanks for watching.